in 1984, an enterprising Australian decided to take a risk. Dr. Marshall was experiencing the same abdominal pain, blotting and vomiting. Ten days later, a camera called endoscope appeared inside his stomach, was teeming with the same bacteria as his patients had. He has also developed a gastritis, a severe inflammation of the stomach, the hallmark precursor of ulcers. Dr. Marshall's idea changed a misconception that still persists this day, that ulcers are caused by stress, food, or so much stomach acid. Marshall thought the culprit was bacterial infections. Initially, his idea was considered crazy by the brightest medical minds on the planet. But in 2005, he received the ultimate validation when they were awarded the Nobel Prize for Medicine. Since the mid-80s, Dr. Top that stress alone caused most stomach ulcers. Patients were given antidepressants or tranquilizers told to visit health spas. Dr. Marshall pinpointed a spiral shaped bacteria called Helicobacter pylori or H. pylori as the real offender. H. pylori is one of humanity's boldest, most frequent companies have joined us at least 50,000 years ago. And now, in 50% of people, yet H. pylori survives acidic thermoly of the stomach with a variety of features that disturb the mucosal defense in its favor. For example, it produces an enzyme called ureas that helps protect it from the surrounding gastric acid. H. pylori can make over 15,000 patients, many of which are dedicated to maximum its virulence. Dr. Marshall ended up with being fine. After his famous dangerous experiment, he ingested a course of antibiotics similar to the one taken now for ulcers. To be treated by simple antibiotics is the modest trial for the disease which previously needed surgery. Marshall's work also reminded us that scientific progress is not always smooth, but there is value of interesting your proverbial and sometimes literal God. <laughs>